So I've already accepted this quest, but we're going to we're gonna look it over anyway. So a few things to note if you're thinking of doing this. One, you have to have a priest. I don't know if you have to have done the Zalatath quest, but they must have access to at least the transmog. Uh, I'm going to say possibly say to be on the safe side. It's in her inventory as well. She doesn't have it on, but it's in her inventory, along with the other two. She currently has a title, High Priest. She did finish out the Order Hall quests. Um, I don't think you have to have rep with anyone in particular. So, she's done all she can do, as far as I can tell, to you know be familiar with her Zalatath blade. So. And I, I dig the transmog because there is a white version of it, which matches. And it's it's you can't really see it there because her hip thing is in the way and is cutting it off. But that's fine. Now, how do you even get this quest? Um, you have to have access to the world quests, which means you either if you've not done BFA. You have to do open up the three footholds, get the foot, three footholds in BFA, war footholds, and then that will open up, of course, be max level as you can get in BFA, which I think is level 60. And that will open up the world quest. Once you've earned it on one, you earn it on all of them, but they have to take an extra step and speak to someone um, on the boat. I think it's... Ah, shoot, I forget his name. Um, but he's on the boat. He's on the on Alliance, and he'd be on the boat in Zuldazar in uh, if you're Horde. Now, I'm not sure if you speak to him, speak to uh, Collector Kojo here. I'm pretty sure you probably see him in, in Nazir. So it is. I was. I'm sorry. I played, spent more time during this expansion. Uh, No, Nazmir is up here. That's what I was thinking. In Zuldazar. I think he might be up here where she hasn't been to there yet. So the map's not open. There's a Tortolan area around here. I think that's where you would go there. I'm not sure, though, on that part for her side, so I apologize. Thing is, is that once you open up the world quest, there will be certain que world quests that say Naga attack. Usually around the shoreline. There apparently is none there, so I'm going to look. I'm, I'm very annoyed that I can't find one now when I need one since. That's not there. Really? All right, let's see if we can find one in Zuldazar. In Zandalar. Or Zuldazar. Um, damn. Really? It's amazing. Everywhere I'm looking. Naga attack. Yeah, it's one of these uh, old dragon quests. World quests. You can see it. They all look the same. It says Naga attack. Um, during that... While you're doing that quest... something will drop and it'll offer you another quest. And the thing that will drop, I forget. It says it here somewhere. Let me open up my map. I believe we should trade with people of all races and creeds, except the Naga. Horrible creatures. Clearly doesn't like the Naga. So it should be orders from Ashara. Whatever, what you get is you, I think like a, a scroll or something drops like that. And it's the quest you get is orders from Ashara. You bring it to Collector Kojo. He says the following. Um, retrieve, retrieve Zalatath and find the makeshift altar. Zalatath acquired complete um, makeshift altar found. So I already had Zalatath. If you go in as a priest that has, that has Zalatath, 
you get slightly different dialogue options. Um, if you go in as, and you're not a priest, because anyone could do this, you don't have to priest, you don't have to be a priest to do this. He has Zalatath on a table or something next to him that he gives you and tells you to take it. Blah, blah, blah. Get on with it. I missed him. All right, let me open that up again. So, he found, oh, you find a medallion. There you go. Zalatath the Quired Complete, makeshift altar frown. This medallion is inscribed with orders commanding the Naga to invade our shores and seize artifacts of power. So just study as you thoughtfully. I've heard tales of a priest who used a horrifying dagger to fight the Burning Legion. It said this blade, Zalatath, whispers secrets of the deep. It might be our best chance of uncovering the Naga seek. I'm told the Naga have an altar on an island in Stormsong Valley. If you take Zalatath there... The dagger may reveal crucial information. So, if you are not a priest with Zalatath, he tells you something about the blade not feel, not make, making him feel uncomfortable. Um, Mr. GM actually has a whole thing of this quest from a non-priest. So I'm going to also link that. So you can see what it's like for a non-priest. But a priest gets a little bit extra dialogue. And I wanted to do this because we all know Zal's coming back. And I wanted my priest ready to deal with this. Um, I have no idea how shadow priests and void elves are going to factor into the upcoming stuff, but let's see. So, I have the quest already. It's on my map. We go here to this island. The funny thing is I remembered it was on that island from when I did it before. And um, I went there and nothing was happening. Oh my god, this little turtle's running crap. And of course, you can dragon ride now in uh, in DFA. I've been enjoying doing older quests much more since I can dragon ride. <laughs> Everything's faster. So, all right, she is a priest. I also have to remember that in BFA, things don't die quite as fast as they did before. Well, but they die fast enough. So. Okay, she found the altar. Something ominous with spring dagger. Zalatath placed orders for sure. So there's a place. Of, there it is. You can see it. You can see it on her as well. You feel a familiar sensation as Zalatath reaches out to your mind. A beguiling blend of dread and delight. Every little death helps. The whispers are faint, but grow louder as you hold the blade in your hand. So weak, need blood. Souls. A voice, a voice trails off. But you can still sense the dagger urging you on. It is a familiar sensation. Assist Zalatath in recovering its strength. Strength failing. I need blood. Souls. So now you have to charge it up. With blood. Souls. Look, we've got Naga. We'll use them. They go. I'm sure it's fine. My queen, I have failed. To the abyss with you. And yes, um, she, even with the transmog, but she will talk to you um, in Legion areas, at least. She's like, did you like that when you kill something? <laughs> it's like, oh, the queen! She's 
trip. Okay. So we, we gave her a little we gave her a little nom noms. Little soul nom noms. Little souls to nom on. Okay, you want an extra one? <laughs> Go seriously, F Ashara. Ashara's great though. I'm not gonna lie. I love Ashara as a villain. She's fantastic. Hate her as a night elf. <laughs> love her as a villain. Ah, much better. How cruel of you to leave me in such a state. <laughs> well, we can reminisce later. No doubt you have many questions. As you know, I can offer countless answers. Unintended consequences. Salatat speaks once more. The servants of Nazoth prepare for their master's return. They intend to conjure a scouring storm to wash away all unbelievers. The particular ritual they will invoke requires three ancient artifacts. One of void, one of storm, and one of ocean. Even now, I hear the void relic calling to me. It is being empowered, corrupted. I am not sure which. I see it upon a cliff, overlooking a vast sea. Come, priest. We could find a much better use for such a prize. Find the void stone in Drusthar. How glorious it is to be renewed. Though I haven't forgotten your callous misuse of me in Silithus. Such a waste of potential. It pleases me that we have a chance to spend more time together. You should know that of my many companions, you were my favorite. We will accomplish remarkable things together, you and I. Magnificent things. There's a reason I'm doing this on a priest. <laughs> And there you have it. I'm not in the waifu crew. The I can change your crew. I don't fall into that. Um, group. Her aspirations are not questionable or mixed. You know, I, I could take a little, a, a little evil. A little deviousness, a little conniving, a little scheming. But for a greater good. <laughs> nah. Unless they really change her lore. Unless they change this a lot. I don't know about that. She's not a gray area. She's pretty straightforward. Just what her ultimate goals are, we don't know. But anyway, there's a reason why I did this on the priest. So. <laughs> let's help her out. I have, I do have a conundrum. At the end of this, oh look, this gear I don't have as an appearance. Um, I do have a conundrum. I'm going to juice far. So, just far. I don't know why I call it juice far. Roost far. I know how to dragon ride. I'm doing it on the expansion. So, oh, she's on one of these. She can't. She doesn't have whirling surge. Right. I may have to ship to a dragon mount. So, um... So yes, yeah, so you can tell there's certain dialogue that's unique. Her comments about Silithus, I did not... And that was one thing I was worried about. I did not take Syrah to Silithus to do the quest where she empties the weapon of power. She is, of course, carrying the unpowered weapon because you all, that's what you get. It, it unpowers itself. It unpowered itself at the start of uh, Shadowlands. Or at the end of, uh, end of, no, beginning of BFA. The expansion that I'm playing in at this time. But, um... The so, beast has returned. Quickly, chase it away before it causes more damage to the wall. Sorry. Um. Yeah. So. 
Aerial halt. So I wasn't sure if I had needed to do that part, but she mentions it. it so you don't have to go to that. Like, you don't have to go through all of... Uh, that may have been a pre-patch. I don't even remember. But it, anyway, it treats as if you did. So she's upset that you drained her <laughs> to deal with the sword. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I didn't even sit there. Oh, I need to see it. But I was like, all right. Oh, shoot. She actually thinks she can break open the stone? Fool. Were we not pressed for time, I would enjoy watching her fail. Notice she just killed um, the one leading this. Whose name is Iannis, Chronicler of Whispers. Let's open it up. Unleash the void stone, my champion. It should provide the strength I need to help you find the other two relics. Okay. I think this is what I think it is. Yep. Yes. Yes. It's been so long since I took a mortal form. This body is pleasing. Don't you think? Yeah. <laughs> Once again, you proved deserving of my admiration. Such a worthy champion. So many possibilities. Let's click on her a few times. What do you seek? Tell me what you want. What do you seek? Tell me what you want. Do you not have a noise language? So many possibilities. Maybe not. Tell me what you want. She keeps asking me to tell her what I want. All right, let's go on. Unintended consequences. The time comes soon. A change of pace can be invigorating, eh, Sirlet? Such magnificence waits us. Do not be distracted. We have more to do. Open your mind to the whispers. Yeah, I got my heart of Azeroth got powered. I sense another relic. The pirate's treasure. A trident the thought lost in the depths. It calls to me, Sirlet. Do you hear it too? Its song takes form. I see a harbor to the east. An ambitious pirate, greedy and proud. Completely unaware of the power hidden within her hoard of gold. The would-be captain's hubris will not permit her to simply hand over her prize. I fear she must be taught a rather harsh lesson. But that is your speciality, is it not? Find the second relic. The time comes soon. A powerful Naga once possessed the trident. Now his underlings seek to recover it. What delicious irony that a pirate keeps such a coveted prize as a trophy. We are going. That way. A local farmer's pigs went missing in the thick of the woods. Save them before the spores take hold. 
I'm going to switch to a dragon riding mount. Like this, this is dynamic flying, but no, no. Shoot, where did I put that? Oh, I didn't decorate you at all. Oh, I hate using an undecorated mount. I'll have to work on that. Yeah, being able to dragon ride makes going through older zones much, much quicker. Pirates are raiding Vigil Hill again. Will they ever learn? Help the Marines fend them off. Man, you're doing a world quest inadvertently. Of course it's freehold. Hopefully I can bypass most of what I... Zalatat's here already. Hello. What do you seek? Are you ready for what comes next? I don't know. So we're in freehold. Uh, we'll just. I actually pressed the wrong button. I have Pip's friendship badge on, so you will randomly see green animals pop up next to me. That's from the uh, Mutrasil raid. Uh, I don't know if it's the best in slots. There she is. Lieutenant Elspeth Wavecutter. Black Tooth Brawler. Skeleton Key. Sorry. I could have made Captain. Now we got a skeleton key. And there's a chest here. I think this chest is here regardless if you're on this quest or not. Trident of Deep Ocean. So many possibilities. Is a trident in your possession? Such magnificence awaits us. I never doubted you for a moment. Aw, kitty. Zelatath breathes it <laughs> deeply and smiles. The tempest crowd. My strength grows. I can see it clearly now, the third relic we seek. The crown known as the Tempest Collar. How fitting that after the fall of a Telgral, the Glutinous Toatana would be the one to find the artifact. He was always scuttling about in the debt, seeking treasures for his collection. Toatana's greed has left him trapped within a cave he can never leave. The crown awaits us there. Retrieve the third relic. Now, the problem with this is I think I have to go to Zoldatar and I haven't opened that up yet, but it's it's quick to open up. Oh, open it is no mere coincidence that our paths intersect. You are meant to find me. I was meant to find you. A grand destiny lies before us. Surely you sense it as well as I. But enough musing. Make, Make your, your way, way to the shores of Voldoon. That is where the third prize awaits.
So... No, I meant to use the new mount. I'm going to have to swap those out at some point, but right now we'll just deal. It does have a swirling type attack, but it's not easy to get in this location. You have to build up static. find it. I'll find it. Don't worry. There we go. I've been making that mistake since the start of the effect. Oh, we need boat. There's boat. Boat, 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 not boat, not boat, under boat, boat. Soldier, our work has just begun. Orders, dispatch points, but other than that means you. Fortunately, we have few choices as to where we can set up camp. Stick around, I'll go over the battle plan, listen to Commander Wormbane, battle plan, speak of the Grand Admiral Desert, delegate, blah 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 blah. Light be with you. What's your plan, my commander? I just need to go to I just need access to Sentinel. Two locations, it's all bizarre. Sometimes she wishes she was me. By the light, the first strike below. I would say that was foreshadowing about uh Mecha Gun. But a gun already exists. <laughs> They're already asking me to go there in this end game, end of expansion, everything's available. But I'm best friends at Urktos. What can I do for you? Sorry. Self is also farewell. So we just need to get there. So that's all there. That should be all there is to that. Um, what I'm gonna do? Actually, she's a normal mount. I'm going to open up flight points. Here. You need something? See you around. Be careful. That See comment about, about, the unfake, about the Forsaken was unnecessary, my dude. But I get it. We're at war right now. There's a Tortolan spot here. If I ever decide to farm for rep and BFA for some reason, I want the flight points open. <laughs> so I don't have to deal with this. But yeah, it's a Tortolan. Yep. It's not the most ideal one. 
So I'm going to try to get the most ideal one. Because I kind of mentioned before that uh, the turn-in spot for Horde is possibly here. And you might maybe do it in a different order. No, 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 you can't. I don't know. I don't know how it works for priests. I have. I know I've done this quest on someone. Probably, definitely Arleia. Because I had the thing on my head. You'll see. She's not getting rid of it. She's going to have it on her head. She may get rid of it one day, but I'm going to hold on to it through midnight, I think. Normally, I would say this character is not one who would. Actually. That's good, old man. Okay, I'm built I am building up the energy I need. Here we go. And then you could do that. I think there is one neutral spot up here. I'm gonna grab. Well, I have to go near there too. Now, I remembered now what this part of the quest is in reference to. And it's funny. Because it seems so recent, but. I got my uh, life point open. So, the name was F. I forget the character's name. This way. So, I'm going to look it I up. I doubt Toatana will give us the crown willingly. Why, Toatana? I hardly consider that fair of you to say. Well, we will see about that. You don't actually get to hear what uh, Toatan is clicking angrily, so she's talking. To, there she's talking to him. Now, he should look a little familiar, though maybe not obviously so. He's got. Gold on his back and gems. His name is Toatana. Um, it's a reference to Moana. <laughs> uh, Tamatoa is the crab that they go to to get. Uh, I forget. They had to get a thing. Anyway, <laughs> I can't look right now. But it's a reference to that. It's a giant blue crab. They like shinies. 
shiny. Um, so yeah, that's what that's about. So tell me what you want. Zeltath and the the crab are talking. I want to take a good look at him. Yeah, they just they just took some uh, some gold specks on him. But, uh, but there's definitely some interesting things going on with his eyeballs. But anyway, let's let's. Uh... He is an elite. Oh, okay, he went down. <laughs> he might take require some more energy. All right. And I got a thick crab claw too. Woohoo! Tempest collar. You can feel the potential energy pulsing within the crown. I should have been reading the other ones too, but, but I forgot. So, all right. So many possibilities. The crown is far more useful in our hands than the claws of an oversized bottom feeder. With the jokes. Continue. Such magnificence waits us. Further proof that you and I could achieve great things together, Cyrilay. So many possibilities. The time comes. The, relic the relics are ours, as it was meant to be. Looks at this. Open He's come back. Mind. Where'd she go? Damn it, I lost her. Where did she go? Oh no. I didn't accept the quest. Oh, good. She's at the other one. I was like, oh no! Oh no, did I just bug out the quest? That will suck. What do you seek? So now let me read this. There is but one more step needed for the great truths to be revealed. The Naga sought to summon their storm from a place that echoes with ancient power. Though this site has had countless names over the years, you mortals know it is the precipice of oblivion. I'll go on ahead and begin preparations. Join me there. Meet Zalatath at the precipice of, obli of oblivion. The time comes soon. What a would have been nice. All right. Then again, would I trust anywhere she would portal me to? No. A uh, faster route might actually be to just Go back to Valdraken. And then back to Voralis that way. Um, Cause the precipice of oblivion, I'm a, I, I know where it is. This opens up a raid, is what this does. So if you do the raid, the, the quest opens up the raid, everyone gets to do this a little bit. It's just more fun to do it on a priest. I could have sworn I did it. I thought I had done it on her, but I did not. And I have another priest. I may have done it on her instead, but she's Horde. So getting to, to Burrell's would have been a pain in the ass. Getting her to uh, Kul Tiras, rather. So I may just be thinking of other two other of my other characters, but I forgot who Got it on Horde. It's bad for Alice. is called Twist the Knife. Nearby, 
And those who would seek to abuse it for their own ends, you've got to stop them! Sorry, Magni. I can't deal with the ruins right now. I don't even know if I can access this area. I'm about to find out. You can get... There's a portion of it that gets really weird on you and then kicks you out, so... Okay, this is the precipice of oblivion. This is where I need to go. I don't know. I'm sure it's got tentacles. It's fine. It's absolutely fine. This is the raid, by the way. So, Crucible of Storms. I don't think I have to do it. Here we are. Oh, do not be afraid. This was always meant to be. There we go. You can walk right in because you're part of it. I think you can walk. Yeah, there we go. I'm going to turn my sound off now. to call forth the darkness. A weapon forged in the depths. A crown for the ruler of all worlds. Hear me, God of the Deep. I have brought you the opener, the bringer of truths, the torch that lights the way. Honor our book, free me to find my own fate. Go, but the blade must remain to serve my will. A fair exchange. Shadows guide you, my dear. We will meet again. I am certain of it. I have dreamed your destiny, mortal. The hour is close at hand. That which was sunken shall rise. All that was sleeping shall I remember having the thing on my head before I even do it. So now she's got it. Um, and what it is is gift of Nazoth. You are special in the eyes of Nazoth. He sees all. So she will have this on her head. She, ha I have the toy by the way because I did get it removed. But she will have this on her head whenever she's in BFA content. But I believe other players that ha you'll see it on other players that have it. <laughs> it's another shadow priest. <laughs> I'm, they might be doing the same thing as me. I know I'm not the only person who decided to do this suddenly. So, yeah, so she has the, um, it's on her head now. Um, uh, oh. What happened? I didn't 
go back. Wait, how am I back in here? What just happened? <laughs> um. Okay. I didn't, what? Okay, that was bugged. How do we get out? How do I get on out? Can I just run through here? Do I die? This is freaky and weird and bugged. Uh, this off. How do I get out? All right. I think what I'm just going to do is I don't know what happened right now. I was just walking away. Is I'm just gonna go. Yeah, they're all here. I can't talk to her or anything. But anyway, as you can see, she has it on her head. So I'm just going to go back to... Um, that is the entirety of the quest. Uh, there, There is a follow-up where you can get it removed. Um, I forget if it's given to you or you have to talk to someone in particular, but I'm not doing that for her. She's going to wear it. She's the candidate who's wearing it now. I wasn't sure she was going to do it. It took me this long to decide, <laughs> apparently. I thought she'd already done it and cleansed it. But nope. Anyway. So let's just go back to Veldraken. I can't go back to Veldraken. I can't go back to Veldraken. Let's go to... Let's take a little long route. Because I just went to Veldraken to get back here. Let us go to Dalaran. That was a bug. Yay. Alright. Now I see, she won't have it on her when she goes to Dalaran. She'll only have it when she goes to BFA. Um, and I will prove that. I'm going to, like, anywhere in BFA. If it's BFA content. So she might have it in the, um... Invasion zones? In the old world as well. I don't know if she'll have, like, the BFA updated parts. I don't know. I never tested it as far as that. I got it off of our layer real quick. Because she would not have that on her. But she may tinker in darkness. She doesn't stay there. The sister, canonically headcanon, she is her sister, tries to walk a different line. So, no, she does not have it on her. But if there are other people wandering around Boralus with it, she'll be able to see them. Better. Also, that happens. You get whispered to. But yep, it's back in her head. I'm going to take a quick look around. I mean, if there's not that many people, I'm not going to worry about it. But I was going to look around to see if... Uh... Oh, Twist the Night, there's a place to turn it in. So... This quest is where you would tell Brother Pike of what transpired here. He cleanses it from you. Um, but you don't have to get a cleanse, so she's not. So I just wanted to show that whenever she goes into this area, she's going to have it on her head. But right now she's going to go... They can't see it on her head. Only other people with it on their head can see it. That was funny in the weeks after it got... This quest came out. <laughs> you saw it a lot. But she's going to go to... Uh... Back to Stormwind.
I know, she's gonna go. Wait, what? Why is it on her head? Why is it on her head in Stormwind? What? Oh god, it's not working right. Alright. Let's go to... Let's go to Veldragon. It shouldn't be on her head in Stormwind. <laughs> what have I done? It's not on her head. Okay. And she, the buff or debuff is not there when she's in Bell Dragon. I don't know why it should have while she was in Stormwind. That was weird. So. I will just leave her here though. 